Hello there ladies and gentlemen, and I'm back for another Let's Play Rescue Rangers 2. With Chip and Dale in it, of course. So yes, we are at the amusement park now. Fat Cat escaped into that uh, big white building on the left with all them satellite dishes and hid there. I'm not really sure what the purpose of that building is, it looks a bit like some kind of factory, which is a bit strange considering the fact that it's in the middle of an amusement park. So anyway, for those of you who already know the gist of the story, you can just keep on watching this cutscene, or you just skip ahead. For those of you who don't, the gist of the story here is to go to each part of this uh, amusement park and locate the little keys that are required for you to enter the control building that looks like a factory. So I decided to start with the clock tower. Why not do things in order? So, yep, we got a bit of a mining theme going on here, in the clock tower, strange but true. And mice that are electrocuting themselves like Megavolt from Darkwing Duck. <laughs> Very interesting enemy design, but uh, that's Capcom for you. And a very well done, <laughs> for your old games at least. You have sort of started screwing things up since roughly 2003 with Resident Evil 4. But before that, I did absolutely love every single one of the games that you made. Well, most of them anyway. <laughs> the ones that were Resident Evil and your Nintendo efforts anyway. <laughs> and there. <laughs> you just threw a hammer at me, so yeah. I hide in your little hatch in my little box. And Punya. <sighs> a nice and slow level. Nice and easy for the most part. All I have to do is climb all the way up and it will all be sorted. Have no ammo for this guy, so I just have to avoid him. No harm in that. You don't have to kill everybody. In fact, if you just want to speed run, you don't have to pick anything up. Because, well, let's face it. It is absolutely easily possible to complete this entire game without getting hit once. I've done it. Trust me on this. I just sort of <laughs> lost my way. Lost my way. Let's say I haven't played this game in a long time. But anyway, we're just gonna carry on going. Pooling enemies and Hmm, I haven't been to that place in a right, and I fell! I can't believe it! Arr. See, this is what happens when you deviate from the usual program. When you go exploring things, you shouldn't really be bothering exploring. But never mind. I tried, I fail, not gonna bother. I'm probably gonna <laughs> try to hurry up through this level now. Do a little bit of a speed run. It's not really necessary to pick up all the boxes, considering I probably... Well, I think, fingers crossed for this one, but I hope that it counts, even if I lose my life. And if not, doesn't matter, I've already got five hit points, that's the maximum. After that point, there really isn't an awful lot that you need these r, &R logos for. I just pick them up just to be a completionist. If that's the correct word, I don't know. <laughs> when I do these little vlogs, I sort of start to forget how to speak English properly. Yep, that's a little bit of social anxiety for you. Oh well, at least I'm trying. <laughs> yep, th for the last three videos I didn't even need to edit my uh, voice. I've sort of been uh, winging it, doing it live. I hope I'm doing a good job. At the end of the day, we all need to improve somehow, because I'm planning on doing a documentary series and uh, reviews. So yeah, here comes the boss, which is a relatively easy one, because this bird is a simpleton. All you have to do is just have the right <laughs> reflexes, and you should have no trouble kicking his butt. Yep, as long as there is a... Uh, no uh, ammo in your hand, or one of them cogs anyway. Uh, either one of those cogs that falls on the floor 
will actually be solid to the floor, so you can just pick it up and throw it at him. For the most part, you just jump over this guy or hide above him. He doesn't go up on the second floor all the time, as you've noticed. Yep, all this battle takes is a bit of uh, reflexes, really. Quite easy. Very easy. See? I bet I'm not gonna get hit even once by this guy. Don't know how much I bet, just, you know, bet of honor. See? Nice and easy! And we're getting more count. Hmm, six. <laughs> I wish I could actually get six hit points, but never mind. So yes, uh, comment, share and subscribe, and I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next Rescue Rangers video.